Our junior escape lead, Alyssa Eanes, shared the following escape room adventure with us. We found ourselves stuck deep in the forest of Wonderland for this adventure. We were unsure where to go and what to do next. We'd searched the room several times, tested locks, triple examined various items we had gathered for future puzzles, we were assuming. We'd even carefully examined a towering stack of books, artfully used to create a doorway to another part of the room. Now, in our search, we noticed a worn copy of the Alice in Wonderland book near the bottom of the stack in this really cool alcove. But both escape leads present had tugged at it without success in removing it. So we were stuck. We asked for a clue from the giant caterpillar in the room, and he told us to look for the best book ever. It had to be the Alice in Wonderland book we'd been tugging at, right? So we went back, we pulled on it again, and it still wouldn't budge. One of us used our entire body to pull at the book, and it finally popped out from the stack. We were able to get that last piece for the next puzzle we needed to escape the room. Both of the escape leads on this adventure are well known for being persistent. So why did we allow ourselves to get tripped up over this book? Well, we put a limitation on ourselves. We shouldn't be tugging harder than this. Even though logically it had to be a part of the room. I mean, it's a well-worn Alice in Wonderland book that looks like it's been tugged at or messed with before. So the lesson in this adventure for you is this, quit limiting yourself. Reflect on where in your life you aren't tugging hard enough. If you want that promotion, go get it. If you wanna open that business, go do it. You are the only person that's putting limitations on yourself. So go for the stars. <laughs>